Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel where we discuss important health-related topics. Today, we're going to talk about erythromycin, a drug that is commonly used to treat bacterial infections. We'll be discussing its uses, how to take it, warnings, drug interactions, and how you can save money on your erythromycin medications with the NSURX prescription benefit card. Erythromycin is a macrolide antimicrobial drug that functions by inhibiting bacterial growth. This medication is used to treat a wide range of bacterial infections, such as pneumonia, skin or soft tissue infections, and many others. It's important to note that erythromycin is ineffective against viral diseases like the common cold or flu. When taking erythromycin, it's important to follow your doctor's instructions carefully. You should take it by mouth, usually before a meal, and on an empty stomach for the highest absorption efficacy. If you get nausea, take it with food or milk. Take the medication whole and avoid chewing or crushing it. The duration and dosage of treatment will depend on your medical condition and response to treatment. If you're taking it to prevent certain bacterial infections, make sure to take it exactly as directed by your doctor. However, there are some warnings that you should be aware of. If you're allergic to any ingredients in erythromycin, you should not use it. There are also some medications that can have undesirable or harmful side effects when combined with erythromycin. Make sure to inform your doctor if you're taking any of the following medications, levastatin, simvastatin, pimazide, or ergotamine, dihydroergotamine. You should also inform your doctor if you've had long QT syndrome, liver or kidney illness, myasthenia gravis, a cardiac rhythm issue, or an electrolyte imbalance. Additionally, drug interactions can alter the way your medications work or put you at risk for serious side effects. Make sure to maintain an inventory of all the products you use, including prescribed and non-prescription medications and herbal supplements, and share it with your doctor and pharmacy. Other medications such as amiodarone, dofetilide, pimazide, procainamide, propafenone, quinidine, and sotolol can cause QT prolongation. Other medications can interfere with the removal of erythromycin from your body, which can affect how well it works. If you're prescribed erythromycin, you can save money on your medications with the NSURX Prescription Benefit Card. The NSURX Prescription Benefit Card can help you save up to 80% on your medication at more than 35,000 pharmacies across the United States. The more you shop with NSURX, the more NSUR coins you will receive as a reward. That's all for today's video on erythromycin. We hope that you found this information helpful. Remember to always follow your doctor's instructions when taking any medications, and make sure to inform your doctor of any allergies, medical conditions, or medications you're currently taking. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comments section below. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next video.